I got ten. And there's a copper bottom pot here. Copper bottom pot. Uh, look, it takes you straight to Rusty Bucket. I don't have to Yeah, just take the fucking cauldron to Rusty Bucket. I mean, it's all good. Where are you going? Over here. For what? Because why not? What you do? I'm gonna go open Rusty Bucket back. I got good ground. It's really not a bad steel texture. I mean, for being the Nintendo 64. There's a lot of textures for being the Nintendo 64 that aren't bad. I read something about um, what is this? the way they had to come up for the with the, uh, oh. for the textures for this. That was just like it was a really cool article. I have to look it up again and talk about it some more in the next episode when I have some time. What do you have? Rare fun? is also the company that made Donkey Kong uh, Country the way it looks on the Super Nintendo, which is fucking mind blowing. Blowing minds. Yeah. Blowing minds and I wish dropping I, I, rhymes. I wish I, could rem fucking Jesus I wish I could remember more details about that article. There's a lot of cool stuff in there. I forgot how to open it. Oh, I gotta go back. I'm an idiot. Like, it's not, it's not apparent now since it's such an old game, but they were... Uh, Rare was really ingenious about, like, the way they did their graphics. Do I have to go back? A fish does not give a fuck that I'm here. Yeah, actually, come and think of it, like, compare this to Mario 64? This shit's all over Mario 64. Mario 64 is very, very difficult to go back and play just because of how shitty everything looks. Yeah, I agree. But this, it looks pretty good. It looks... It looks pretty, like, wow! It looks pretty close to PS1 era textures. Actually... There's some PS1 error text. That don't look as good as this. The thing you gotta remember about the N64 is that they actually had attempted anti-aliasing for the N64. Brave New World. And they didn't do a half bad job. Um, Wasn't uh, the Dreamcast capable of uh, running a game at 30 frames at 720p? Something like that. Hey, a mumbo token. God, I wish the Dreamcast didn't die. The Dreamcast was an amazing piece of technology. It was. It was ahead of its time. And I missed another mumbo token. And Rest fucking... in peace, Dreamcast. I hope you're chilling with your ghost homies in Mad Monster Mansion. I missed the fucking uh, mumbo token in Mad Monster, and I remember now. It's does Dreamcast idea. abide by ghost law? Now it does. It has to. That's how it works, Dave. Ghost law is law. Do dead consoles dream of electric sheep? Only a little. Are ghost consoles electric ghosts? Oh my god. I mean, are dead consoles electric ghosts? Are dead sheep electric sheep? <laughs> what it do? That is the question. <laughs> Question that has haunted us for millennia. What it do for millions and millions of years? Uh, bah, Since bah, the bah, dawn bah. of man, man has wondered, would it do? Hey, look at thing. Science has answered many of our questions. Like, what does it do? <laughs> and but never, what it do? Fucking wandering. This is... Oh god damn it, go in the map blah blah, blah blah rusty bucket. I have to find the entrance. I mean the not the entrance, the uh the jiggy thing. What jiggy thing? The thing you put the jiggies in to open the level. Ah. I thought the cauldron took you there. No, the cauldron takes me to the entrance of the level. Um, no, I think this is gonna take me to the place. Oh. There we go. Alright. Is that it? Yeah, I got it. Thank god. I fucking walked right past this. I was like, oh yeah, this is probably nothing. 
Probably nothing. Hooray! I'm it blind. Has begun. I'm completely blind, everyone. We I already agree. know that. Remember that time that you were blind? <laughs> you ran that red light? Oh god. <laughs> Mike, the light is red. Oh! Mike, it's red. Ah. Mike? <laughs> it's cool. Mike, you just ran that red light! Oh. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> well, to be fair, it was the middle of the night. No one was around. Who gives a fuck? You know you would have been complaining if you got pulled over, though. I would have complained all the complaining. Haha, <laughs> that was funny. I appreciated that. <laughs> I needed that. Oh no. Is this the engine room or is this the kitchen? This is. Storage with room. TNT. I don't remember anything about Rusty Bucket either. I'm pretty much useless from here on out. Yep. Ooh, I have this. Pep. I have all the power again. No! Oh my god, I never thought I'd do that. What, get hit by the eel? No, I didn't get hit by him, I fucking punched it. Oh. And then oh. that happened. But it's cool, because I survived. I will survive! I will survive! I will survive. You ever do that? You just sing a song and you hope that you're remembering the lyrics? All the time. Hold on, did I miss anything? You're midway through singing the wrong lyrics and you're like, oh well, I guess I'm committing. I've already committed to this. These are a commodity that will not be wasted. What? Where is it? Oh my god, I just- oh, it's back here. Needed. I will pick up Wait, when use... did you use two? Because you were at nine. Oh no, when did you use three? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Accident. You used one to get through that tunnel full oh, God. of branches. I forgot about that. Can I kill that? No. No. No, I can't. Wait a minute. Is that breakable lamp? Uh, lamp. I think one of these is. There's a bunch of them that are. I can't jump that. What kind of weak bitch are you, Banjo? You punk. It's carrying like a 1200 pound bear. It's a banjo. I was talking to the 1200 pound bear. Oh, I thought you were calling Kazooie weak. Kazooie's weak punk bitch, too. Bro. You can't blame a bird, a ladybird, not to mention. What are you, sexist? Yeah. <laughs> bird I mean, sexist? no. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck this thing up. This is the only part of the Rusty Bucket theme I like. Because it's the progression one, not word. Progression one? Am I learning more music? Yeah, if you want to. Yay! I now know the progression one. My musical knowledge is expanding at a rapid rate. You play bass, how do you not have musical knowledge? Because I play everything by ear. I don't know all this music theory bullshit. Neither do I. Well, that's a, that sucks for us. Give me the fucking Ikamokum. I wanna learn all about Ikamokum. Anything about music? I think like, I'm so shitty with music, I can't fucking tell instruments apart in like an orchestral piece. I swear to god, there was a game that I played where they had like a knife graphic on the ground, and if you stepped on it, you got hurt. <laughs> that sounds like what uh, old point and click adventure games would do. Oh no! Get out of the oven. Soon I will cook bird and bear. We'll make delicious pizza out of there. Delicious pizza soup. We got a lot of eggs in this in this refrigerator. Frigid air. It's not even closed. The eggs are probably bad. We'll collect those. Why? I shoot them out of my mouth and butt. Oh, okay. Actually, Do you I ever don't. eat a raw egg? Never. It's, uh, it's not as awful as people make it out to be. 
probably tastes really... I think... It doesn't taste like anything, it just feels like... I can imagine... Globs of, like, slightly hard... Or not even hard, um, slightly thickened jelly sliding down your throat. This is... The bad thing about it, though, is, like, you, you get salmonella that way. Or you can. But still, I beat the odds. I am a superhero. I'm like Rocky. <laughs> First Jiggy in Gruntilda's quarters. <laughs> also, what is in Gruntilda's quarters? What why is does she have a boat? Why is this guy on her bed? Oh. Is there a point where you go below the ship? Yes. Uh, you, oh right. Yeah. In this horrible, disgusting, oily Remind water. Remind me when you do that. I forget what is so special. No, I don't. I, I don't mean below deck. Oh yeah, obviously there is because there's all that shit around the ship. The you have to go pretty damn low. Wait, three one two one one one. That's uh. That's, that's for the, something later. It's a whistle. It's the whistle code. Three one two one. one. Actually, where is the whistle? I might as well do that now. I think the whistle's around here, isn't it? Oh. I think it's actually on top of the... the, the, the... No! Oh, is that poison? No. It's just... Dirty ass water. Yeah, oh, you... wait, here it is. Um, Wait, go a little bit into the water here. What? I don't... No, go left into the water. Why, so what the fuck? Look, look at the text on the bottom of the ship. T W Y C. It's like, it, I, I think that's a Twycross, England? That's where uh, Rare Headquarters was. Oh. Yeah, the, that's what it was that's so special about this, this water is that just merely being on top of it. You start drowning? Yeah. That's a bullshit mechanic. Not only that, air is you. Do you get a, a move from Bottles here? No. Bond I, bottles oh no. the Jinjo Master? I might die. <laughs> Try not to. Might drown. I might drown. Nah. No, I'm gonna drown. Nah. See? I had faith in you. Oh, the dolphin. Oh well. The dolphin? The dolphin. Baby. The baby. The baby. I wish that this was like other game. I don't remember actually. I, I wish this was like other games with regenerating health and cover systems. And shooting. And bullets. Bullets. And a series of poorly scripted sequences. No, but I'm I not... wish this was Battlefield 3. No, I'm actually referencing, like, other games of its style, where if you started to drown, you would, like, if you lost all of your air, you would start to lose health instead of just dying. Yeah, this is much more like Sonic. Yeah. Well, Sonic didn't have health. Sonic had rings. Yeah. Which was basically health. Yeah. yeah. Just try to jam your head in there. Yeah. Uh. Hmm. I love gold feathers. I love gold feathers. They keep me from death, and I am grateful for that. Oh, this is the shark pen. Oh, that's okay. I get it now. I remember. We're gonna need a bigger boat. It's actually the reason why the shark hasn't started attacking me. I believe is because. Of things. Try not to fall off. No, I mean, I gotta get in there eventually, anyway. You smash through that window up there, right? Is that Snacker? Yeah. He's what is Snacker doing here? Snacker. Snacker. Come here, buddy. Ah, oh, give me a little. Piss off, you stupid shark. I got time for you. Oh, I thought you flipped through the fence, I didn't see the hole oh. there. 
Oh, one of the biggest things that I was all worried about this level was the whole fucking, uh... For some reason... No, I had, I had, th I had thought in my brain that brains have stems. Did you know that? Brain damage. Uh, no, I, I, I forgot. It's, I, I, I had thought. I, I had thought that Snacker's all over the place when he's just no, in No, he's that. just in there. Yeah. He's just in there chilling with the brain stems. The brains. Why, why, why is this so easy to get? It's a trap. Snacker's gonna come out of the wall. And be like, I'm Ghost Snacker. I'm haunting your ass because it's haunting time. Because I don't abide by the law, by the ghost laws. <laughs> ghost law functions different for sharks. After years of ghost segregation between the human ghosts and the shark ghosts. What about those green ghosts that Grimpilda has? They're different. Huh? That makes me think. <laughs>